Peggy 18. Promise me you'll play it cool up ahead. Hey, they used to call me Mr. Cool. No one has ever once called you that. Ever. Are you really worried about this? These DUP guys may not have the same level of power that you... that natural bioterrorists have, but the government infused them all with enough to still do some serious damage. Well, you have just officially ruined my Seattle vacation. How long did you say I was out for? One week. Wow. That means the DUP put all of this up to... Yep. Oh, they've kept busy. Once we're through, I'll check with a couple of my cop buddies and try and get access to the police databases. In the meantime, I need you to just lay low. I might spook them if I show up with a bioterrorist. Okay, boss man. A registered firearm. I'm a police officer. Hey, he won't let me on his bus, won't let me meet his friends. Must be back up. I think I prefer the smallest. Uh, 
No time to check, man. I got dupes coming at me from every direction. Get the hell out of there. Yeah, great advice. All right, Reg, I hate to ask, but any of your besties in blue know anything about these core relays? Yeah, well, apparently they've got them set up all over town. Seattle PD's been keeping an eye on them, so the EUP won't tell them what they do. But you can find out where they all are. Sure. Like I said... Good. I need you to send the locations to my phone. What? So you can keep tapping them for more powers? No, forget it. Wow. My own brother wants me to fight the ultra-mega bioterrorist of all time with less powers. Look, I didn't say that. Well, I guess I shouldn't put it off then. Better go straight on to Augustine now and get it over with. Not sure what's gonna happen. All right, all right, I get it. Look, just stay away from Augustine and I'll send you the ones I know of. Thanks, Reg. You're the best brother ever. <laughs> no, the best brother ever would have locked you in a closet back in Salmon Bay for the rest of your life. Wow. Not sure a closet can hold a conduit for long, but I appreciate your wanting to lock me up. Reg, you should see this, man. The DUP's completely trashed this city. All the people are walking hunched over and nervous looking. Yeah, well, that's how martial law works. Control the city and the people by breaking them both down first. Yeah, well, occupying armies suck. You may want to keep that to yourself for now. Reg, those uh, core relays we saw on the way here must have been cracked by all that destruction. This one's sealed up pretty tight. I doubt the DUP is going to let you borrow their keys. You're probably going to have to break them open. Oh, look, I just happen to have some mad new breaking skills. This is gonna be awesome. Look out below! Not <laughs> bad, huh? Bet you wanna see it again? Nelson, I've got some information on the DUP's communications network. Now, there's a central antenna so they can coordinate the movements of all the smaller districts. All right, any idea where this central communication thing is? Well, you did say you wanted to see it while you were here. Shut up, Space Needle? Space Needle. Top of the needle. It's a nice day. I'll just climb to the top. Hey, Reg. Hypothetical, you know, theoretical, totally what if question here, but what would be the explanation for how I might be able to draw the power from some conduits, say, oh, I don't know, Hank, and not others, like. One of these dupe troopers. Oh my god, so you did try earlier. Hey, I'm not looking for an I told you so here, Reg. I'm just looking for... I thought the dupes had those things locked down. Well, I suppose that hypothetically, theoretically, it could be you 
you can only drain powers from a conduit who has them naturally? A prime conduit, like Hank, or hopefully Augustine. And the DUP guys got all their weaker powers from Augustine, so maybe they can't pass them on, even to you. So you're saying we have to keep going? Read you loud and clear. Don't push it. And next time, don't lie to me, okay? Trust your brother a little more than that, will you? Man, this stuff's even uglier from the inside. Looking forward to taking this stuff down. Hey there. It's Betty. Who are you? Oh, hi, Betty. I'm at the Space Needle. Oh, I'll, I'll try back later then. Bring me a postcard. <laughs> okay, if the gift shop's open. Bye, Betty. Bye bye, kid. Aren't you a cypress? This is more like it. I'm on the uh, observation deck. Don't let your guard down. Onward and upward. Going. You're almost to the top. Alright, time to gouge out the eye of the needle. And that must be what holds it all together. What the hell? Huh, I haven't seen you before. Reg, man, they got a small army up here. Good. They're in the right place. Or that they really don't like other people playing with their stuff. Come on, focus, Delson. You see any way to take down the communications? Yeah, yeah, there's this uh, anchor. Looks like it's holding all the antennas in place. Yeah, I don't think this is going to cut it. Nothing bad ever came from getting new powers. <laughs> oh, this is going to be epic! Goes away. Hello, Science Center District. I lost you. Do you read me? I'm getting nothing, sir. You? Nothing outside our immediate area. Yeah, Reg. Let's go find us some prime conduits and get some new powers. We own the streets! Take it easy. A few streets in the immediate vicinity, all right? The DUP still owns the other 98%. But we kicked them off the space needle, man. You knocked out their comm center, okay? They may be deaf, but they're not dumb. Kicking the DUP completely out of Seattle is going to take time. We just got here. You know what they say. The journey of a thousand miles begins with a single kick-ass tag. Who says that? The Chinese people. Hey, Reg. You see it from down there? <laughs> Are you kidding? People in Portland can see it. I just want to let the dupes know I'm here, man. What the hell is that? That's not one of the three who escaped. Oh, cool. What's the symbol supposed to mean? Not sure. The banner man got away before the Duke reinforcements got here. Delson, I've been asking around about the escaped bioterrorists. Do you think I maybe need like a PR guy? What, what the hell are you talking about? Uh, people here are starting to call me the banner man, which, A, is unbelievably lame. Uh, maybe not the best idea, you hanging around the Space Needle right now? Well, I mean, why not Smoke-tastic man or, or 
Hell, just the smoker. Look, I'll keep trying to get a lead on the escape bioterrorists. Why don't you see if you can disrupt other DUP operations around there until I get back to you? Bannerman. <laughs> Pretty lame, right? Yeah, I just heard. And can we please not use the B word? What? Bioterrorist? Yeah, you know, that's just a slur invented by the DUP to make people scared of conflict, man. Look, whatever you want to call him, let's just track him down and find out what he can tell us about Augustine. And drain his powers. Okay, fine. And drain his powers. I'm telling you, it's gonna work. All right, they just found a body of Fifth and Briar. Go check it out. But promise me, you'll be inconspicuous? Yeah. Listen, Delson, it, it's gonna be police officers at this crime scene, okay? Not DUPs. Now, I'm here to support you, but killing cops... I got it, I got it. I'll put my phasers on stun. Get back. This is a crime scene. Okay, I did it your way. I'm past your boys in blue. Thank you. Although, what's the use of having smoke powers if you're not gonna use them? Ah, there's my baby brother. Well, found the victim. Definitely the work of a conduit. It's very... showy. Okay, I need you to take a couple pictures of the crime scene and send them to me. Anything that might give us a lead. There's your wounds. I wonder what kind of power did this? Fire blast or lasers? Ooh, what about flesh-eating death gaze? <laughs> I wouldn't mind absorbing a little flesh-eating death gaze, right? Delson, even if the guy who did this is a prime conduit, we still don't know if this power transfer thing's even gonna work. Well, you know what? If it does, my first victim, it's gonna be the guy who came up with the name Bannerman. Bro, you really need to let that go. Okay, sending you the picture, but I think he blinked. Uh, Reg, I'm hearing sirens, man. Yeah, let me check real quick. Yeah, the DUP's just cordoned off the area. I've warned the Seattle PD to stay away. It has to be the conduit. I'll check it out. You know what they say about secondhand smoke? Get the bio, no, it's get the conduit! Jeez, and good luck with that. Conduit sure got a certain style. Kind of nouveau sick. Okay, I just need... <sighs> Let me guess, face and wounds. If it's not too much trouble. All right, there you go. Stand by for wounds. No need. I got a hit on the face. The guy's a drug dealer. Rap sheet's a mile long. Look around for his stash. Might give us a clue why the sniper chose him. Holy! 
Holy what? What holy? Delson, are you okay? Yeah. Found our sniper going after him. Be careful. Real original advice. Wait, 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 wait. Don't impale me. I come in peace. Hey, it's okay, I'm one of you. I mean, one of us. Would you slow down? I'm not gonna hurt you. Especially if you don't slow down. No, he ran fast, like, like really, really fast, conduit fast, man. Screw flesh-eating death gaze, I don't want that. No, don't be greedy. Funny thing, man, I, just before every shot, you can see the neon sign behind him dim a little. Uh, must be his power source. Then head back to the sign, see what you can find. All right, I'm here. Any idea what I should be looking for? Just anything that might help with who our sniper is. Well, one thing this place tells us is that our sniper is a sniperette. Wait, what? You should see this, Reg. It's like the girliest sniper's nest you've ever seen. What? What does that even mean? I, I don't know. It's just girled up. Girl stuff. Like the name Brent burned into the wall in girly handwriting. And it is definitely the best smelling assassin's den you could ever be in. Okay. Uh Look, just send me photos of anything you think might help. I wonder who Brent is. I can't help you there. Okay, I can see how you might think those are women's shoes. Yeah, they're like size negative. Seriously? A serial killer who reached Jane Eyre? Oh, totally. Jane Eyre is like the female catcher in the rye. Okay, those definitely very likely belong to a woman. Like you know. So, anything else interesting? Relax, I'm looking. I guess this counts as interesting. That's interesting, all right. You know, it's a long shot, but maybe if I run this through the database, cross-referencing the name Brent, I'll get lucky. You know, if I had smoked and lasers, I could, like, Put on light shows in our living room. Oh, that'd be putting your powers to good use. Hey, Reg, I was uh, I was just thinking about the bras. Well, stop, okay? Seriously, just stop. Okay, I'm thinking when I get to Augustine, it's gonna be like, whoom, smoke, and then once I got on the ropes, it's like zap, zap, I'll whip out the laser show. Well, it's good to have a plan. Hey, I got a hit on the photo. Name's Brent Walker. One arrest two years ago for minor drug possession. Get this, found dead two months later in an alley. Cause of death, a single puncture wound of unknown origin through the chest. I'm sending you the address now. Yeah, our girls definitely got a thing against drug dealers. <sighs> sure seems like it. It's weird though, man. If she's just killing drug dealers, then why do the news reports make it sound like she's picking off random victims like it could be anybody? Yeah. Well, you'd think the DUP would want people to know the killings weren't random. That if you're not a drug dealer, you're not in danger. That'd sure bring the panic level down. So you're saying what? The DUP is trying to scare people? I mean, their job is to control the panic.
All right, I'm at the alley, but there's a bunch of heavily armed dudes here. Looks like a drug deal's going down. I hate to go all cop on you, but it is the duty of every citizen to step up when they witness a crime in progress. So now you do want me killing people with my powers? I didn't say kill them, just rough them up, scare them a little, and destroy their stash. Uh, no, they didn't belong to me, and it's my duty as a citizen to respect other people's property. French, you should see this, man. Speedy gone crazy is a tagger. She's a pretty damn good one, too. Yeah, well, don't forget she's a murderer, right? Pretty damn good one, too. She sets a lovely altar. It's actually kind of touching. Yeah, well, there's good touching and bad touching. You gotta admit, girl makes a mean vortex. And now we come to the highlight of the tour. Okay, that is full bore crazy. Okay, so the girl stops off for takeout, comes here to sit with Neon Brent to tell him all about her day while she chowders down. You know, Olaf's has a location on Alaskan Way. He's supposed to have one of the biggest neon signs in the city. Hey, if I had neon powers and a Chowder Jones, that's where I'd hang. I am on my way. Okay, this is good. Surveillance. Hobo style. Good. Why didn't I take some cash off those dealers? Money, why do you hate me? Be my friend, Money. Come to me. Let's bond. No! It's okay! God. This again? Just like last time, Delson. Concentrate. Oh, no, 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 no. You're not getting away. I got this now. Speed of light, baby. Just leave me alone. Run up walls? <laughs> you have got to be kidding me. what I came to do!
Take. Yeah, lady, you've got to calm down, all right? Just relax. You're not taking Just me wanna... back! I am not going back to Curtin K! Good news is, less juice for her. Bad news? I am not a knife person. Maybe stop trying to kill me, and we can let the beer signs live to see another day. I am not going back! I'm not weak anymore. Not anymore! That was awesome. Listen to me, I'm not with Augustine! You're one of the goddamn robots! How many times? Wait, are there really robots? I just want some of your powers, that's all. Just leave me alone! Powers, I know you're in there. Surprise me. No. Oh, I am so gonna use this. As a little girl, I never thought it'd be me. That I'd be one of them. My powers were a surprise. My parents turned me in. They knew what the government would do to people like me, and they did it anyway. I didn't know what to do, but... My brother Brent just grabbed our coats, and we ran. Those were hard days on the street. Moving from city to city, no comfort anywhere. Until we met some dealers, and man, they hooked us up. The drugs. The drugs were heaven. But then we always wanted more. And the withdrawal, agony. Always looking for a fix. And when you lose your stash, when you think someone stole it from you, the drugs, the dealers, they make you do things they... The government picked me up easy enough after that. But it wasn't a regular jail. They trained me to shoot, taught me how to kill. So on the day of the crash, I escaped with all those skills. Everything I needed to set things right. Brent, I promise. Every dealer I find, I'm gonna burn your name in their chest. No one else is gonna suffer like we did. No brother. Nobody else. <laughs> hey, Nelson. Nelson, you all right, brother? What happened? Oh, she did good. You did good, buddy. Come on. Get up. Get up. Oh. Whoa. <laughs> Hey, you did good. I know just where to put filth like this. Somewhere where Augustine won't find her, and she won't be hurting anybody else. Hey, no, 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 no. She's just killing drug dealers, man. Killing? Nelson, murdering drug dealers. What do you think I'm doing to the DUP? What you have to to save the Akomish back home. She stays free. 
No. Dude, no way. Look, just because you have the same affliction, not gift, affliction, doesn't mean that we're gonna pick up every little piece of trash we find. Look, I'm never going to abandon you, all right? Not ever. This one goes in a cage. Hey! It should be my responsibility. Yeah, because responsibility is not exactly something you excel at. I got this. Fine. I'm here for the tribe of the Holland bioterrorists. I'm a conduit! He's cool. He's normally cool. He's just... Not today. Yeah. Let's talk.